have a special chance to develop relationships with individuals that will last a lifetime because we are student athletes. These bonds are naturally formed on the field, court, track, or course, but they are strengthened even more during the bus trips and team dinners in the dining hall, as well as following each success in every setback. Those around you have made you the finest version of yourself and depend on you just as much as you depend on them. I am certain that the past four years have had an enormous impact on our lives of the student athletes that are seated in front of me. Even if we may have changed throughout these four years, we only just started the entire journey of change. For the nurses graduating today, how fitting is it that we celebrate you today, May 12th, the final day of National Nurses Week, and Florence Nightingale's birthday. And for those of you graduating from mental health counseling, how fitting that we celebrate you in the month of May, National Mental Health Awareness Month, a time of year to raise awareness and erase the stigma attached to mental illness. Congratulations. We are proud to bestow the President's Medal upon Anne Costello. You should be proud to be a Fisher nurse I am proud to have had the opportunity to work with all of you who have made this institute a model of education and humanity. Thank you to all of you and for this great honor that you have bestowed on me today. To my fellow graduates, congratulations. I've had the privilege and pleasure of watching you all grow, learn, and succeed through these programs. The future of healthcare is integrated, with mental health and physical health sharing equal priority by providers and systems we have. As graduates of the Wegman School of Nursing at St. John Fisher University, you are especially well positioned to be leaders in this care. Together, I know you will. It has been a privilege and an honor to work with so many students who choose to develop their capacity to work collaboratively for the common good. Again, on behalf of the faculty, staff, and scholars who collaborated over these many years to make the First Generation Scholarship Program a great one, I thank you. There is no paved road ahead, my friends. You will make the road by walking. But you are not alone in this journey. In your knapsack, you can call up the joy you found in stumbling upon an unexpectedly beautiful passage in a novel, the delight of discovering an image in a microscope. As you leave tonight, with your tassels turned, remember that you came here because some part of you saw the value in continuing to learn. Nourish that part of yourself, and take it with you as you go out into the world. Be prepared for new perspectives. Welcome the possibility that you may look back on yourself on this day and marvel at how much you've changed. Search for the things that bring you joy, particularly if they are unexpected. Today is a good time to celebrate your success and thank you, much gratitude, to the class of 2023. On behalf of the School of Business, we wish you a long lifetime of blessings, good health, curiosity, strong networks, and the ability to pivot so your every dream comes true and you too say every day, where else would I rather be? The American dream has different meanings for everyone, but for me, it was about becoming the first person in my family to graduate from college and attain a well-rounded education. This moment right here is the manifestation of my American dream. At the St. John Fisher University School of Business, we all acquire new skills, gain knowledge, and form long-lasting relationships with our peers and professors. To our amazing instructors, Thank you for equipping all of us with the necessary skills and knowledge to ensure that we will become day one ready in our journey. You have been guided by the Ralph Singleson Junior School of Education's Social Justice Mission. Social justice is our central philosophy, deeply rooted in the Catholic tradition in which we were originally founded and served as the central focus of the life of our patron, St. John. Consistent with this tradition, we seek to provide our candidates with insights of a more just world in which people treat one another civilly and honorably. The world and the work await you, and we can't wait to hear from you again about all the wonderful ways you have changed the world. Teaching requires that you grow not only in your content knowledge, but adaptation so that you may be able to meet students where they are at the, the time that they need it to ensure their success. This is our call. This is our mission. This is our collective story. 
we are proud to bestow the President's Medal upon John Carl. Thank you for choosing this great profession and investing the last four years of your life in preparation for this day. Thank you for carrying the torch, being involved in fighting for our ability to take care of our patients. This profession, the profession of pharmacy, this great profession, is already better and the future is brighter because of you. Throughout the last four years, we have witnessed your development into professional, empathetic, service-minded clinicians prepared to serve our communities. As many of you now begin your careers in community pharmacies, hospital settings, residencies, and many other pharmacy practice settings, we wish you the best. Throughout these four years, this class has displayed persistence, determination, and perseverance unparalleled by any other through the pandemic and shown through our rigorous curriculum. Along with being there for each other, the adversity that we experienced helped us grow as people and as pharmacists, helping develop the problem-solving and critical thinking skills that we need on the job. If you're graduating today as a member of the Wagner School of Pharmacy class of 2023, you have already proven that you are not only smart, but you're resilient and you're adaptable. Trust yourself, it's necessary for us to trust our experiences and more importantly our intuition going forward. I believe that being a pharmacy student in this program has taught me that. Being a Fisher Pharmacist is a real brand, you wear it proudly. Being a Fisher Pharmacy 23 is a level all on its own. Graduates of the class of 2023, think of the people that have helped you on your journey. Siblings, mentors, teachers, parents, coaches. Just as your personal communities contributed to your success, it's now up to you to engage with new and different communities and contribute to their success. Perhaps an alumnus helped you some point in your journey here. You are now in a position where you could be of service to future Fisher students in the years to come. There will be triumphs, setbacks, joys, and sorrows. But I encourage you to remain engaged, committed, and dedicated to your communities and your values. My hope is that your education has been a transformational experience that has made a positive impact on you. You should know that you have made an impact on our great university as well.